Hello guys, this is a step-by-step -step tutorial teaching you how to sideload Android apps to your Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD, Kindle Fire HDX. For the transcripts and other Kindle Fire guides, please visit KindleFireForKid.com. You may already know that your Kindle Fire tablet, including Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD, Kindle Fire HDX, actually is an Android tablet. The Fire OS 3 in the new Kindle Fire HD, Kindle Fire HDX 7 and Kindle Fire HDX 8.9 actually is based on Android Jelly Bin 4.2. So, you can run almost all Android apps in Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX. Sometimes, you may need some apps that are available in Google Play, but are not available in Amazon App Store. Because the official way to get apps on Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX is through Amazon App Store for Android, you have to sideload apps to your Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX if the apps are from other sources. This tutorial will guide you to sideload two Android apps to your Kindle Fire HDX tablet. It also applies to Kindle Fire and Kindle Fire HD. Let's start. Step 1. Enable apps from unknown sources. In the home screen, swipe down the notification bar. Tap Settings. Tap Applications. Tap on for apps from unknown sources. This will make it possible to sideload apps from sources other than Amazon's official app store. Tap OK to acknowledge the warning message. This essentially tells you the risk of sideloading. You need make sure you only get apps from reliable and trusted sources. Make sure the apps from unknown source is on. Yellow color indicates this option is on. Tap home button to return to home screen. Step 2, download and install one mobile market app. To sideload Android apps in Kindle Fire. Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX, you need find the APK file. Although you can do this manually by visiting individual developers' website, most developers now do not put APK files on their website. Instead, most of them put a link to Google Play Store. One mobile app can be a middleman between your Kindle Fire. Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX tablet and Google Play Store. With one mobile app, you can get almost all apps that are available in Google Play Store. Sometimes, it may even help you overcome the geographic limitations for some apps. Some apps are available in selected regions in Google Play Store. One mobile may download the app even though you are not in the targeted regions. So the first Android app that we need to sideload to Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX is one mobile app. Now, let's start. In the home screen, tap Silk Browser. This is the default web browser in Kindle Fire tablets. In Silk Browser, type the address. Choose the tablet version of the one mobile app. Tap and download the app. The tablet version is optimized for bigger screens in tablets. Tap OK to start the download. Once the download for one mobile app is finished, tap the menu button, the three vertical dots, of the Silk Browser. This will open the options of Silk Browser. Tap Downloads. This will list all files downloaded through your Silk Browser. Tap the APK file entry as shown to install one mobile app. Tap install to finish the side loading one mobile app. In landscape mode, you need tap next to see the install button. Tap home button to return to home screen once the installation is done. Step 3, add one mobile market app home screen. Once in the home screen, you cannot find the app you just installed because none of the apps sideloaded to Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX appears on the home screen by default. So, after you sideload Android apps, 
you need manually add it to the home screen so that you can access them quickly next time. In the home screen, tap apps. Tap on device. You should find the side loaded apps now. Tap and hold the one mobile app icon until the context menu pops out. Tap add to home to add a shortcut of one mobile app in the home screen. Tap home button to return to home screen. Now, scroll down the home screen, you can now find the one mobile app there. Step 4, Disable Update Notification and Show Notification. One mobile app is useful, but sometimes, the notifications from one mobile are a bit annoying. You may want to disable them. Now, let's start. In the home screen, launch one mobile market app by tapping the icon once. Tap one mobile market menu icon, the three vertical dots. Tap settings. You may want to turn off enable update notification and show notification. Drag the on button to the left to switch to off. After finishing the setting, tap return, back, button to return to one mobile market app. Step 5, download and install Chrome for Android app. After side loading one mobile market app, you can install almost all apps that are available in Google Play Store. Now let's try to sideload Chrome browser to Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX. In the search bar of one mobile app, type Chrome. You will find out that Chrome browser is there. Tap Chrome browser Google to download the app. Once the download is finished, it will prompt you to install. Alternatively, there is a notification in the notification bar, you can tap it to begin the installation. Before the installation, the permissions of this app are listed. You need scroll down to fins the install button. Tap this install button to install Chrome browser in your Kindle Fire tablets. Once installation of Google Chrome for Android is done, Tap Home button to return to home screen. Step 6, Add Chrome for Android app to the home screen. As mentioned before, after you sideload Android apps to Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX, they are not shown on the home screen by default. You need add the sideloaded app to home screen manually. In the home screen, tap Apps. Tap on Device. You should find Chrome for Android is listed there. Tap and hold Chrome app icon, until the context menu pops out. Tap Add to Home. This will add a shortcut of Chrome for Android app in the home screen. Tap Home button to return to home screen. In the home screen, scroll down, swipe up. You can find Chrome now is listed in the home screen. Step 7. Test Chrome for Android app on your tablet. Now you can test the side loaded Chrome for Android on Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX. Normally, after you side load Android apps in your tablet, it is a good practice to test it. In the home screen, tap Chrome app icon. Chrome browser should launch in Kindle Fire. Kindle Fire HD and Kindle Fire HDX now. In the address bar, type Kindle Fire for Kid.com. And, it works. Congratulations, now you've sideloaded two apps. Next time, if you find the apps that are not available in Amazon's App Store, you can try to search it in one mobile market. You can find more tutorials and guides on Kindle Fire, Kindle Fire HD, Kindle Fire HDX, at KindleFireForKid.com. If you have any questions, please ask us in our website. Thank you for watching this tutorial.